Hello darlings, it's another TRT Q&A with me, Paolo Bracotto. And today's question comes from Alan Thompson. And he asks, hi, my doctor recommended me to go on testosterone, but I am worried due to the fact once you do it, you can't stop. You have to do it for life. If you had to do it all over again, would you have taken the therapy? Any information will help. Thank you. Great question. So let's get right to it. So basically, let's just correct the, uh, the idea that once you go on TRT, you're on it for life. Um, while that is common for a lot of people, that's not always the case, right? There are cases where people go on TRT as a way to kind of kickstart their testosterone naturally. And then once that happens, they can then slowly, slowly, slowly wean themselves off uh, TRT and, and let their natural testosterone levels take over. So um, a good example of this, you have this a lot with sick people, you know, where they get sick and they get very weak and they go on TRT kind of just to supplement their low T while they're sick and getting treated. And then as they heal and get back to full health, their testosterone levels go up as well. Or take, for example, a fat person or an over, a very like overweight guy, right? So what might happen is that because he's so overweight and he's so unhealthy, his testosterone levels are low. And then what will happen is they will put him on TRT treatment, help him to have that energy and drive to kind of take steps to get healthy, get back into shape, lose the weight. And then as part of that process, a lot of the time, that can also kickstart their natural testosterone production. And then once they lose the weight, they get healthier, they wean themselves off the TRT, and let the natural tea take over, okay? So it is possible, but you obviously, everyone is individual and have their own set of circumstances, and that's why you have to go to a doctor to discuss these things first. And you see this a lot, you know, uh, with younger people can maybe use TRT to kickstart their, tea, their, their natural tea levels and get them back on track, and then they take it over because they're still young. But maybe for older people, you know, heading towards your 40s, 50s, and 60s, well, then naturally your T levels are going to be low just naturally, right? So in those kind of cases, then you're more inclined to be on TRT for the rest of your life. So yeah, this is obviously why it's important to monitor it as well and not to just go on it blindly, get tested once, get TRT, and then just continue with it for the rest of your life. Got to go for tests and blood work regularly, at least once a year to see how things are going. And you've got to experiment as well. And your doctor will tell you this, you know, they will say, let's increase it or let's decrease it. Let's see what happens when we decrease it. Do your levels drop? How do you feel? And, and you kind of play with it and you adjust it according to how you need it, right? It's not as black and white as, as that. Now, so your question is, you know, knowing that you're going to, if you start TRT, there's a high possibility that you're going to be on it for life, right? Well, like I've said on numerous occasions in my videos and on this channel, uh, for me, uh, that sacrifice is more than worth the risk, right? And considering that my levels had been low for probably ages, um, I, I'm quite happy with that. Yes, it's going to be a bit expensive, especially if you're paying for it privately, right? But the benefits that you get from it, the mood improvements, just the general well-being and confidence and happiness that you get out of it, you can't put a price on that, right? So would I do it again? Absolutely. And that is why I'm recommending this to everyone as well, because uh, you don't know what you're missing out until you get on it, right? You, you think it's a risk, and you're like, oh, I don't know, you know, once, once I go on it, you know, I'll, you know, I might not ever be able to get off it. Yeah, but you're going to feel great. So what do you want to do? You want to just sort of eliminate that one thing and then be miserable for the rest of your life just so that you can say, well, I'm not on TRT or that I don't have to go back on it. I, I think that's ridiculous, right? You, most people know, especially those that have gone on to TRT treatment, how good this is for you and how great it makes you feel and that there's really no comparison. Don't even worry about whether you're going to be on it for life or not. If you are one of those few people that has to be, the benefits far outweigh that little sacrifice that you're making of having to be on TRT. So I think that's it. Would I do it over again? Every single fucking time I would, without a doubt, 100%, right? There's no dispute about that. So 
I hope I answered your question. I'm quite passionate about that one because it's a no-brainer for me. And hopefully you can use that as kind of a bit of motivation or insight into your decision. If you have questions about TRT or my experience on TRT, then just leave it in the comment section below and I'll answer it in a video like this most of the time. So thanks for the question. See you next time.